वेलकम टू वर्डिकम आई एम अनन्या सिंह एंड यू आर वॉचिंग टूडेज लीगल न्यूज वेर वी अप्राइज यू विद द रीसेंट इंपॉर्टेंट लीगल डिवलपमेंट्स अक्रॉस द नेशन हेयर आर द हेडलाइंस तमिलनाडु गवर्नमेंट टेल्स सुप्रीम कोर्ट दैट मूवी थिएटर इज नॉट प्लेइंग द केरला स्टोरी इन द स्टेट ड्यू टू पुअर परफॉर्मेंस एंड पुअर ऑडियंस रिस्पॉन्स सुप्रीम कोर्ट टू हियर प्ली ऑफ सिक्सटी एट गुजरात जुडिशियल ऑफिसर्स हुज प्रमोशन वर स्टेड बाय द टॉप कोर्ट इन जुलाई Supreme Court hears CBI's plea for extension of time to probe in the Adani Hindenburg case. CJI DY Chandrachur appreciates Justice MR Shah, calls him Tiger Shah as he demits office. Delhi High Court reserves order on PIL for seeking complainant's willingness before polygraph, narco and other tests. Tahir Hussain moves Delhi High Court seeking to quash FIR in 2020 riots case. Now let's take a detailed look on the headlines. The state of Tamil Nadu in a petition filed by the makers of the Kerala story alleging a shadow ban on the movie and the theaters in the state being under an obligation though not official by the state to not show the movie said that the theater owners had voluntarily stopped screening of the film from May 7th onwards due to poor performance of actors and poor response of the audiences to the movie as it lacked well known actors The state government denied all claims of the shadow ban and called the allegations of the filmmakers false the plea filed in the supreme court also sought relief for the ban issued on the film in west bengal the supreme court agreed to hear in july a plea filed by judicial officers from the state of gujarat whose promotions were stayed by the top court the top court on may 12th stayed the promotions of 68 lower judicial officers including the surat chief judicial magistrate harish hasmukh bhai verma who had convicted rahul gandhi in a defamation case the judicial officers were reverted to their original post held before the said promotion the matter was mentioned before a bench comprising cji dy chandrachur and justices ps narsimha and jv padiwala who said that the matter will be listed after the summer vacation in july the apex court had earlier said that the said promotion was in violation of the gujarat state judicial services rules of 2005 which states that promotions must be made on the basis of merit come seniority principles and after passing of a suitability test a bench of the supreme court led by the cji dy chandrachur and justices ps narsimha and jb pardiwala heard the plea filed by the securities exchange board of india that sought the extension of 6 months time to probe into the adani hindenburg case The top court on March 2nd had ordered CBI to probe within 2 months of allegations of fraudulent transactions made by the Hindenburg Research Report. An extension of 3 months was granted on May 12th. Upon considering the report of the justice retired AM Sapre committee appointed by the Apex Court itself. CBI had however sought that it be given 6 months to complete the probe and informed the top court that it has not been probing any companies of the Adani group. since 2016 and the extension of time is meant to ensure carriage of justice keeping in mind the interests of the investors the chief justice of india dy chandrachur speaking at the farewell ceremony of justice mr shah organized by the supreme court bar association hail justice shah calling him tiger shah for his courage and fighting spirit cji said that justice shah's practical wisdom and excellent advice has helped the collegium greatly in making decisions A bench of Chief Justice of Delhi High Court Satish Chandra Sharma and Justice Subramanian Prasad reserved its order on a PIL seeking to direct police to ask complainants if they are willing to undergo scientific tests like narco analysis brain mapping or polygraph tests to substantiate the claims made by them and to prevent the filing of false cases The petition was filed by advocate Ashwini Kumar Padhyay who also sought that similar directions be made in respect of the accused at the stage of recording of statements the petitioner said that such provisions will work as a deterrent and will reduce fake cases the bench in the matter said that it's not a joke it's crpc and that the court cannot go beyond crpc as they are not lawmakers former councillor of the aam aadmi party tahir hussain moved the delhi high court seeking to quash an fir lodged against him for allegedly inciting communal violence during the february 2020 delhi riots the present fir pertains to allegations of rioting and murder against hussain along with hussain umar khalid sharjil imam safura zargar and several others were booked under the uapa for giving effect to the february 2020 riots in delhi 
That was all on today's legal news. Thank you and keep watching Verdictum and subscribe to our channel and download the Verdictum app on iOS and Android to keep yourself updated with authentic legal news.